on September 27th, 2024 at the racetrack Il Sagittario of Latina, just south of Rome, two apparently equal cars engage in a race. The two cars are both Renault Twizzies, Model 80, and the contest is which one can drive the longest distance. One of the cars is unmodified. The other has an ECAT NGU generator on board. The cars are weighed and then the charge of their battery is measured. The first one without the ECAT has a weight of 513 kilograms and its battery has a charge of 98%. The second one powered by the ECAT has a weight of 611 kilograms and a battery charge of 62%. Logic would suggest that the one with greater charge and less weight would win the contest. But note, the Twizy with more weight and less charge is powered by the ECAT, a new energy source that without connection to any other energy source exploits the zero-point energy field granting enormous energy savings. At 10.40, the race begins. The Twizy powered by the ECAT starts first. The other starts after half a lap to grant an equal air resistance to both. As expected, the Twizy without the ECAT stops running at 1 p.m. because its battery is completely depleted. It has traveled a total of 73 kilometers. However, the Twizy powered by the ECAT continues to run at a regular pace. The Twizy continues its pace. The Twizy without the ECAT is removed by a truck from the racetrack while the Twizy with the ECAT continues its regular pace to reach the predetermined race time of six hours. At 5 p.m., the test is determined to be concluded and the ECAT-powered car is returned to the paddock. At the end of the race, the ECAT-powered Twizy has run for 201 kilometers and its battery has a charge of 82%, which is about 33% higher than the charge it had at the start. To watch the whole six hours of the race, please see the full-length video at our YouTube channel 